The purpose of this video is to give you a quick overview of the steps you can take to add a PCI card to our IPC. You can purchase the IPC with select PCI cards pre-configured or you can add them at a later date. To complete this installation, you will need a PCI card as well as a screwdriver. Before installing your PCI card, ensure the card does not exceed the maximum dimensions for the intended slot. This information can be found in the user manual under the computer data section. Once you are sure that your card will fit, start by removing power from the unit. Next, remove the four screws located on the top cover. After doing so, remove the cover to expose the PCI slots. The next few steps will vary, depending on whether you use the PCI slot 0 or PCI slot 1. We'll detail installations of both slots so that you can see how to install the PCI card in any situation. Let's start with the installation for PCI slot 1. Remove the three screws located on the side of the unit as well as one screw on the front. This will allow you to also remove the side panel. After removing the side cover, remove the bracket from the bracket frame by removing the retaining screw and washer. At this point, you can install the PCI card into the PCI slot connector. Make sure it is fully inserted and the card bracket is aligned with the bracket frame. You've completed the PCI slot 1 installation. Now let's review installation for PCI slot 0. At this point, your top cover is off, with the same four screws removed. We start this installation by removing an additional two screws, one located on the top middle and one located on the front right. By removing these, you will be able to remove the bracket frame and bracket from the unit, and then you're ready to install your PCI card to the bracket. By using the retaining screw and washer from the bracket, you are able to secure the PCI card for its assembly. Make sure you position the PCI card and frame so it's resting on the top of the vibration reduction strip. Now carefully push the card into the connectors, making sure that the frame assembly aligns with the mounting holes. Follow up by securing the bracket frame to the chassis with the two screws previously removed you've successfully installed a PCI card into the PCI slot 0. Now that you know how to install both types of cards and are finished with the installation, reinstall the top cover with the four remaining screws and tighten them for security. Make sure that there are no remaining screws, plates, or cover brackets that may have been missed during the reinstallation. Now once you have verified that all the pieces are back in place, reconnect the power and your value line is back in business.